hey guys greetings how you doing i hope you are doing well welcome to vinyl tv if you are new to this channel and if you are please consider subscribing thank you very much indeed for stopping by thank you very much indeed for clicking this is hp mv 4527 this printer is multi-functional printer multi-tax triple in one if you like in the sense you can copy scan and print from this gear this printer right now is connected to wi-fi network okay but i want us to connect this printer via usb cable i want us to set this printer okay and for us to connect this printer but before we do that i want us to go back and basically switch off turning off the wi-fi is what is in wi-fi is turning off from this printer okay right now the wi-fi is off okay so we go back if you switch the wi-fi all right on back the blue light will show here so right now this printer is not connected to wi-fi network what i want us to do is basically to connect this printer to set it up via usb cable i just want to mention this is the usb cable what it looks like unfortunately usb cable is not included with the packaging we have the usb cable here in uk at vinyl tech store we send it to you we send it out to you free delivery here in uk so check out vinyl tech store for usb cable it's tested so basically what i want us to do is basically connect this printer to usb cable before we do that i want to turn this print around so the power cable goes right here so this printer is right now is plugged in this is the power cable so the usb cable goes right here okay it's in now i'm going to turn this around okay okay so before we do that here is the scanner for this printer you stick your documents okay you want to scan and it will do the job okay so i have the book here i want us to scan at some point so i'm going to stick it on the scanner okay if you open up this printer the end cartridges will come right in the middle for you to change it it does it automatically this printer is using 302 end cartridges if you have any paper jam bring this out okay and make sure you put it back okay so you, you hold the spring together and open it up okay right now it's in and also the other thing you can do once you check there's no paper jam you can also close this and also bring out the paper tray if you bring out the paper tray you hold it this way and look at the bottom here for any paper jam or debris as well okay so and make sure you close the paper tray okay and once you close it will ask you do you did you load a paper tray click yes okay right now this printer is set so bring out the other section of the usb cable okay now go to the your pc stick it in okay remember we switched off the wi-fi network source push it in and once it's in you will hear a click sound here we go it will come right for you to launch a mv 4000 series 4520 okay you go on it and click launch app okay once you click launch app it will take you to hp smart app do you want help with hp smart app okay by sharing your data yes or no no okay right now do you want right now is connecting okay right now we have different printer here hp laser jet that was here before so we need to make sure we look for this printer okay the next thing you need to do is click plus right here click plus and once you click plus 
okay you allow it to for you to add another printer set up a new printer here we go this printer right now is showing us right here on hp mv4520 series yes you click on it and it tell you usb port click on it okay and right now it's connecting we ask you connect to wi-fi network not right now okay so we want to connect it this printer is connected to your computer with usb cable so right now this is the usb cable and it's telling us it's connected so you click if you want to connect to wi-fi you select wi-fi but we don't want to do that not right now okay so right now this printer is getting ready this is how to connect this printer to usb cable okay connected print printing service click continue please wait your printer is eligible for hp instant ink okay hp instant ink free four month trial by registering okay click continue now you see select an hp instant ink plan so you need to select the plan i'm afraid it's not free of charge okay so you have 0 0.99 okay or 1.99 or 3.5 3.49 or 9.9 .9, okay for you to print out 300 pages or 22.49 for you to print 700 pages okay so right now this is tutorial so i'm going to select no ink no instant ink okay the next thing you need to do is click continue it's asking us are you sure yes positive okay the next thing we we are going to do right now is once you select you need to click continue and are you sure i no i don't want instant ink click I don't want instant link ink okay right now adding printer okay complete setup to add your printer to hp account you can add or cancel now it's asking us the postcode where the printer is located you can put your postcode okay then you need to click continue let's set up complete let's print so if you want congratulations you are now ready to print from your computer make sure to choose your new printer in the print dialogue okay you can print this right now if you want or you skip page for you to print you just need to select print it will print out this okay but if you want to skip page, then you select skip page okay so i'm going to speak skip page okay right now it will, it's showing us here hp you can see hp mv4520 all in one series is ready so this printer is ready it will show, show you the ink estimated ink level okay right now this printer is ready this is how to set this printer up with the usb cable so this printer is not connected to wi-fi it's easy for you to do this following this instruction sometimes people struggle with the wi-fi so by connecting this printer via usb cable you are ready to go if you want to scan a document right now we have a document here we want to scan then you select scan okay once you select scan okay the next thing you need to do is you select the document type if it's photo you select photo but what we have here is document now also you select the size entire size the output if you want it black you select gray gray scale right now we want want it color resolution if you want the resolution to increase you can select 600 dpi or 300 dpi so i leave it to 300 dpi okay compression is low medium or, or high you select the one you want the next thing you, need, you can also select preview by selecting preview it will fetch the document for you to see okay if you're happy with it then you go ahead and click scan if you're not happy then you change okay you do some adjustments so select preview
okay right now here is the preview for this document to scan if you want if you're happy with it then the next thing you need to do is click scan so right now it's scanning okay so this document right now is scan okay the next thing you can do is if you want to print it out you just need to click print okay once you select print you need to go to the printer section make sure you select the select the particular printer you have here so we have hp 450 mv the next thing you need to do is send it to your printer okay and it will start to print out So right now it's printing out. Okay, so this is the document will scan printed out okay click okay from the scanner and also if you want to share this document with others the next thing you need to do okay is to click share okay once you click share it will give you options okay so you can send it through email you select email and once you select email it will attach your inbox you type the email of that address of the person you want to send this document to okay once you type the email address of the person then you click send okay right now we are sending this document we are sending it back to my inbox okay so if you want to save this document to your file you click save okay once you click save it bring out option for you to save it on particular folder okay you save it here okay can here we go very quick the document just landed okay in my inbox so you can want to save this you can type the name of the document you want okay so maybe write document okay you save it okay then the next thing you need to do right now is saving okay document save click okay so you close this app okay once you close the app you come up Come out from it then you go to your inbox and look for this document inside my inbox this is the document we sent click it open right now this is the document we scanned inside my inbox okay from this my inbox you can actually print it out or share okay thank you very much guys this is how to connect this printer with usb cable scan your document print and share with others if you're happy with this tutorial please do consider to subscribe smash and like this video it helps us to grow okay thank you very much indeed i appreciate you thank you